Well, there's plenty of urban wildlife in Metro Vancouver, but a young deer walking the streets of downtown is something most people have never seen. Mm -hmm. CTV Shannon Patterson reports on the big city visitor that everyone's fawning over. It crossed at the light like a typical rush hour pedestrian. Then it's just like, is that really a deer? Like, you don't ever see that downtown. A young deer strolling down Nelson Street just before 9 a.m. The double or triple take of everybody, and then people are pulling... Um, pulling their phones out, videos, photos. And then there was actually a fellow on a bicycle riding beside it, so I think he was kind of helping to protect it. That cyclist stayed with the deer all the way to Yale Town, where it disappeared. Do you think this is the same deer? I think so. Why is there a deer in the, in the ocean? Maybe the same deer that swam across Burrard Inlet from North Vancouver to Stanley Park late yesterday oh afternoon. We just come um, under the Lionsgate Bridge and we're heading back to the Royal Vancouver Yacht Club. And all of a sudden, one, one of the girls says, is that, is that a deer in the water? And so we all rushed to the bow of the boat. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it was doing a pretty good, kind of like a, I don't is know, deer paddle, great. doggy paddle. <laughs> it was pretty cute. From the North Shore, that's actually a fairly long swim. It's been quite an adventure. <laughs> yeah, if it could only talk. If only it had a Twitter account. When the sighting stopped, the downtown deer Twitter handle appeared. Selfies at Jackpool Plaza, the Gastown Steam Clock, and Chinatown. And at City Hall, a plea for designated deer lanes. It's shocking, but then it's really not that shocking. A requirement, really, for this daring downtown deer. Shannon Patterson, CTV News, Vancouver.